Thanks for watching Flight Plan Video Support. In today's video, we will be introducing Flight Plan Go for iPad's newest feature, the ability to split the screen of your app while in the Maps and Navlog section. The benefits of utilizing the split screen feature include the ability to have multiple documents open on a screen at the same time, which allows you to compare over 20 different options including maps and nav logs to airports, flight instruments, procedures, weather, scratch pad documents, and several tools. To begin, open Flight Plan Go on your iPad. You can tap on either the maps or nav logs icon to utilize this new feature. Tapping on the nav logs icon, you will notice on the nav logs header the split screen button. Tap this button and a drop down menu will appear with the split screen options. One helpful feature is the ability to view your navlog and airport diagrams side by side. Select procedures for your departing airport and select the airport diagram. You will then see the two screens displayed side by side. Tapping on the maps icon, you can access the split screen option as well. For example, select the split screen icon, tap on the arriving airport's procedures, select an approach plate, and the map section of the app will be displayed on the left hand side of the screen and the approach plate will be displayed on the right hand side of the screen. Having your approach plate right beside your map is a powerful flight planning tool to help keep your situational awareness. As well, you can draw directly on your approach plate within the split screen. You can exit the split screen by tapping the close button in the top of the split screen options drop down. You can also turn your iPad vertically to display the split screens on the top and bottom as seen here. Thanks for watching Flight Plan Video support on the new iPad Go split screen feature. If you have any questions, please email us at support at fltplan.com.